<laughs> I thought I'd do just a little like fun thrift try on video um, because I'm finding so much good stuff at the thrift store today and my budget cannot do it and my closet cannot do it but there's so much good stuff so I just want to share it with you. I'm posted up in the knickknacks aisle to try to make my decisions. I have had a wonderful time trying everything on and I winnowed out some stuff, but there's a lot of stuff I still really like and I'm literally trying to spend $10. Um, I was just gonna go through my process with you of how I decide from all the things that I like and that fit and that I think are interesting, um, like what I actually go home with. Um, AKA how to make the most boring purchases ever from the thrift store. Yay! Surprise of the day. Carol Little is kind of like a classic uh, vintage brand. Uh, it's like 70s and 80s and nice quality so you'll see it in a lot of vintage stores and I just like the print. I like this fabric a lot. It's this like really beautiful like apricot printed fabric. What it is is it's these kind of like harem pants. They're not really a harem pant, they're more of like a palazzo pant. They don't really come in at the bottom. It's like a wide leg, pleated, high waist pant. And then it has this top with a built-in vest. Yeah. <laughs> and in a contrasting print. And um, yeah, I don't know. I was, I kind of picked it up for the novelty value. But then when I tried it on, I really like this color on my skin. Um, and it actually was very elegant. This guy is like sparkly and shiny and very like 70s glam rock and roll and I like the cut a lot. I will never ever, not ever wear this jacket, but I really like it. This on the other hand, I can't tell if I would wear this. I really like it. It reminds me of those Gap ads where they were doing like the, all the like choreographed group dancing and stuff, because I think it's from that era. The awesome thing about Gap clothes is that they'll just tell you when it was made on the inside tag. This is my number one, so far only, absolutely for sure. It is a red, cotton, textured, oversized sweater. And it's like just the right muted, faded red. And this is, makes me so happy. So I'm really excited about this one. And this is one of the half off tags. So this one is only $225.
kidding. After all that, it was a lot. It was a lot. Um, I ended up spending six dollars and sixty-eight cents. I also had exchanged a pair of shoes for four ninety-nine, so it was a total of like twelve dollars with the tax. Um, but some of it was a gift card. So I ended up getting this like gap sweater. That very fun winter one. I got the muted red sweater. And I didn't even show this one. I just found it on my way basically to the register. But um, and then this little kind of like chartreuse um, pointel cardigan uh, with a v-neck which I'll show you probably at a later time but so I tried to keep it super budget super usable and yeah I hope you enjoyed the looking as much as I did and keeping it on budget all right see you later bye